First, I would like to welcome the first year of 2020-2021 to the University of Nairobi, the world-class university committed to scholarly excellence. Congratulations for having qualified to join the University of Nairobi, in particular the College of Architecture and Engineering. The College of Architecture and Engineering is one of the six colleges in the University of Nairobi. The college is situated at main campus. The structure of the college. The college comprises three schools and one institute. The School of the Built Environment, the School of Engineering, the School of Art and Design, and the Institute of Nuclear Science and Technology. The college has student population of 6,500 students, 200 teaching staff, and 18 support staff. Senior professors nurture the young upcoming staff. The college has aligned itself with the core mandate of the university, namely of teaching, research, and community service. The course offered in the college produce graduates ready to create suitable man-made fiscal environment. The college addresses two of the big four agenda by producing graduates who are experts in housing and manufacturing. Next. The professional graduates trained in the college, the professional graduate trained in the college work in teams in delivery of construction and manufacturing products and are expected to have high level of professional in integrity and ethics. The society looks upon the graduates to plan, design, and construct sustainable built environment and produce quality manufacturing project products. Professions in the college. The college produces professions in the fields of architecture, planning, real estate, urban management, interior design, surveying, construction management, quant surveying, and engineering, among others. The college graduates produce manpower in construction, manufacturing, and creative arts and design industries. Accreditation of the professions. The program in the college are recognized and accredited by local and international relevant professional bodies such as Institute of Quant Surveying, Institute of Surveying of Kenya, uh, Engineers Board of Kenya, uh, Institute of uh, Engineers of Kenya, Kenya Institute of Planners, Board of Registration of Architects and Quant Surveyors, Architectural Association of Kenya, Institute of Quant Surveyors of Kenya, Commonwealth Association of Architects. The college has produced alumni who have played a major role in the leadership of this country. Some of the prominent alumni include Honorable Musaria Mudabadi, the former vice president, Betty Shemtai Maina, cabinet secretary, uh, Minister of Trade and Industrialization, Professor Chris Pass Kiamba, former permanent secretary, Minister of Education, Professor Paul Mwangi Maringa, uh, PS uh, State Department of Infrastructure, Professor Francis Geshaga, former Chancellor, Jomo Kenyatta University of, of Agriculture and Technology, and architect David Motiso, the Chief Architect, Minister of Public Works, among the designers of KICC. Actually, over 90% of registered professions in the construction industry are alumni of the College of Architecture and Engineering. This, this should inspire you to work hard and aim high in developing your careers while in this university. The college will nurture your talents and mold you to a productive citizen. The School of Engineering is a leading center of professional training in creativity, innovation, and design. And we are the university for you to be in. In fact, we are the leading university in Eastern Africa and in the region. So you are in the right place. And again, you as professionals, as we shall train you, it is a situation whereby we wish to train high caliber professionals in the engineering uh, discipline. We are accredited, uh, accredited by the Commission for University Education. And again, we have our professional bodies. We have Engineers Board of Kenya. We have the Institutes of Engineers of Kenya. We have the Institute of Surveyors of Kenya. The whole idea is by the end of your university life, you'll work under these bodies 
as a initially as a trainee and then as a professional engineer. So it is good for you to appreciate that. You have done very well in mathematics, physics and chemistry. And uh, it is, we always tell students, at this time, don't dwell too much on the grades you got at that lower level. But again, concentrate, it is a course. There are courses here that demands a lot from you. We have uh, different programs. We have civil engineering. We have biosystems engineering. We have electrical and electronics engineering. We have mechanical engineering. We have geospatial engineering. And then we, have, we also have petroleum engineering and mechanical engineering. So whichever program, all of them are very marketable programs. And it is our wish that once you work hard, you'll find this as your second home. Remember, you are our customers. We shall treat you with a lot of respect. You are, we have highly trained staff and our teaching and non-teaching staff. You'll have a lot of workshops, a lot of laboratories, a lot of theories. And it is the combination of all this that makes you a holistic uh, student where a lot of discipline is required out of you. So you arrive in the university, will be five years. This is Dr. Lilac Osanjo, the Director, School of the Arts and Design. And I'll be talking to you and welcoming you to the School of the Arts and Design, where we have the Bachelor of Interior Design students joining us, the Bachelor of Arts in Design, and we have the Masters, Master of Arts in Design students as well joining us today. To all of you students joining us at the School of the Arts and Design, we have two programs uh, together in the room. We have the Bachelor of Arts in Interior Design, BID, and we have BA in Design, Bachelor of Arts in Design. Th thank you for choosing to be uh, with us, and we, will look, we look forward to having you for the next four years. And as you know, design is mainly studio-based, project-based, so we trust that you are well equipped with your instruments and your um, computers so that we can get going. We will be learning a lot of practicals and you'll be expected to be catching up with us. For every studio that we have online, you are expected to do a lot of practice at home. But above all, enjoy the course because design is, a, you have to be passionate to succeed. So build your passion, build your technical skills. We will be sending you a lot of um, links to YouTube and a lot of um, um, programs which we have recorded. So keep up with us. Welcome and please enjoy yourselves and enjoy your time at the University of Nairobi. Welcome to the School of the Built Environment. My name is Dr. Mary Kimani, the Dean of the School of the Built Environment. The School of the Built Environment has four departments and five undergraduate programs. The Department of Construction Management and Quantity Surveying has two programs, the construction, Bachelor of Construction Management and the Bachelors of Quantity Surveying. Those who are coming to that department will be construction managers and quantity surveyors and they are involved in projects in buildings and uh, they will be having studios and they will enjoy the courses. Then we have the Department of Urban and Regional Planning, which also has studio work, projects, and it's an exciting department. And those who are registered there, I'm sure you're going to enjoy a welcome. Then there is the Department of Real Estate that trains estate agents and valuers. I'm sure you will be excited to be able to value an establishment, a house, a, a farm, and you are going to be professionals in that area. Then we have the Department of Architecture and Building Science. These are people who are able to draw a whole house and they are able to give people good designs of houses. They do their work through studio, which is a very innovative way and a very creative way. I'm sure you are young people with very creative minds and you're going to really enjoy working together with those who are in the Department of Architecture and Building Science. Uh, let me say that this programs are all accredited by professional bodies in the industry. They are regulated by acts of parliament and you will be able to go into the industry high head because you will be having professional degrees that are able to earn you good money and also are able to 
uh, make you more and more contribute to the economy of this country in terms of the built environment sector. I urge you to be very serious in your studies and uh, make sure that you engage our professionals, our, our lecturers, and you will turn out to be very good student. Thank you and welcome very much. We shall be together all your four years, five years, six years that you will be there. Thank you.